shoes. Two pairs of shoes. I'll see if they're the same size. As much as Will Trent premiere episode reveals, the detective's history appears to have several facets that will eventually come into focus. Although the instance in his past that involved a police officer has not yet been given in full detail, it has been alluded to. It is revealed that Faith is also connected to the crime during a heated conversation the two new detective partners, Will and Faith, have inside the latter's car. Will had looked into Faith Mitchell's mother in that tragic earlier case, putting an end to her long and illustrious career as a police officer in the process. Faith can never forgive him for this, as he asks if Will can change the past, and the detective has to disappointingly admit that he indeed cannot. The role of Paul Campano, who is Emma's father, also sheds further light on Will's past, or, rather, its very beginning. The two guys instantly identify one another because of their shared childhood. Both of them had grown up in foster homes throughout their infancy, and adolescence, but Paul had a history of being a mean bully, and Will had been his favorite target. Paul still possesses this arrogant and even aggressive demeanor since he is constantly trying to take charge of every circumstance. However, Will has also been emotionally affected by these events, as seen by the melancholy in his voice while recalling those times. Will was also dyslexic, which was due to the lack of care in the foster home, and he is rather frustrated by his inability at present. Will and Faith summon Paul to the GBI office because they believe there may be more information on him there. Paul then starts to cause a disturbance. Paul taunts Will because he and Abigail were also asked to testify in relation to their daughter's kidnapping case, which has angered him. Will then discloses their personal history in front of everyone when a fight breaks out. Abigail, Paul's wife, is also surprised by this and disgusted by his concealment because she had no idea that her husband had grown up in foster care. She continues by telling the police that Paul had a relationship with Dylan, a young woman who had a similar appearance and voice to Kayla. Dylan is told by Abigail that she threatened him earlier that day because of their unlawful connection before she rushes out of the building while announcing her separation to the investigators. As Paul shows up at Will's house late at night at the end of the pilot episode, there is still a lot that is unknown in this respect. He informs Will that he just shot the person who had stolen Emma while covered in blood and agitated. Paul now acknowledges the enormous problem he has just made for himself and seeks Will for assistance. There are many things to watch out for in the Will Trent series, even with just one episode released. The first of these is undoubtedly Emma's whereabouts and her kidnapper. The automobile that had subsequently stolen Emma was seen going through the suburban areas of Lee County, Georgia, in a quick clip in the center. The identity of this individual is shown to have been known to Paul at the episode's conclusion, making the case's mystery one to keep an eye on. Later on, it's possible to meet the prominent grandpa who had convinced the jib to become involved. Additionally, there is the issue of Will Trent and his background. New information on that subject may also be anticipated in each new episode. Angie, his lover, had been looking into drug gangs before she was transferred from vice to the detective department, and this may possibly contribute to the major drama in the future. Internal politics and antagonism between the GBI and the APD also seem to exist, and Michael Ormwood, a police detective, seems to play a big role in this. We may also anticipate some changes in this area. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to comment, subscribe, and give us a like.